yeah, but the hot favorite for the title has really been in really very good form. All called. Chris Everett a little bit doubtful about that call. Famous drive volley, it's a winner. Thank you. Thank you. So, Miss Evert, as I was saying, a hot favourite for this French title, won the first set 6-1 in 27 minutes, and she's held our opening game in the second set, just 19 years of age, from Fort Lauderdale in Florida, anticipating marriage with Jimmy Connors, to whom she recently became engaged, Jimmy Connors, the Davis Cup, uh, US Davis Cup star. No strangers to each other. Last night, these two together won the ladies' doubles title. <laughs> a very yellow, uh, neat outfit with a white band around the waist. And, of course, in an absolutely commanding lead. And the Russian girl has got, I think, a bit disconcerted and downhearted. Love three, second set. Mrs. Moritzova serving. Wanting this to be a hard-fought final, I think. Chrissy Everett in really ruthless form, leading by four games to love in the second set, having won the first 6-1 and making a smash there to win that game as well as Billie Jean King might. Awful problem for the uh, Russian to know how to play on the slow court against the American who makes so few errors. Well, that shows one of the problems. That wasn't a bad Russian drop shot. It wasn't an outright winner. Probably wasn't meant to be, but you see the wonderful counter reply with the angled drop shot from Chrissy. Oh, finally placed shot. Well played, well played. Six one five two. Everything really going the Americans' way. For championship point for Miss Everett. That's it. So Chrissy Everett wins her second championship in a fortnight. One of the most difficult championships of the world to win and sweet revenge for having lost in the final last year here to Margaret Court. A really sterling performance by this 19 and a half year old girl from Florida.
And the score then finally 6-1, 6-2 to Chrissy Everett to become the French champion for 1974.